All right. Is this thing on? Yeah, it looks like it's on. Okay. Here's the deal. We're lost. Ryan was supposed to be here Wednesday night to ride all day Thursday, and then some nonsense about a job got in the way, and he's not here. So we don't know what the hell we're going to do, but we're going to wing it. If Ryan's not here and there's machines to ride, it just means there's no plan, and we're going to go wherever we feel like it. There's no left turn, there's no like sheeted directions under the roof. We're just going to, there's no plan. We're just going to go ride and get lost. So that's that. You are staring at two H-Craft Custom buggies. We've got two Trail Series machines here. This is a 2022 on the right and the 2021 on the left. Let's see what kind of improvements they've made for this model year. It looks really good. He's got an extended cab, I see. The doors are pretty nice. There's a nice little pocket there, a little more refined. Still got his extra storage behind. Oh, there's another upgrade. I see that the uh, air filter cover has been replaced, the plastic has been replaced with aluminum, so that's quite nice. That's a, that's a nice upgrade. <clears throat> got some nice red PRP seats. He's loving that. It looks really good inside. All in all, the machine looks really, really good. He's got a little red rocket on there. I guess he named it after his favorite dog park. It's got 32 inch Zillas on it. <laughs> it has ZRP radius rods on it. It's got SCM suspension, special carriers from his old 18 buggy. I did forget to mention this is all another 18 Turbo S. It's got factory upper A-arms, that's bold. Oh, he's got factory tie rods, that's another bold upgrade. And factory ball joints, well, Sonny, I see you got factory A-arms, factory tie rods, and factory ball joints. Are we leaving the parking lot, or is it just go on and off the trailer? I think I'm gonna put it back in the trailer. Yeah, it's dirty already. No, I mean, it is, I'm the way. Nice. All in all, it looks really, really good. Next to its big brother over there on 35s. 106 inch wheelbase. The trunk's been upgraded. My trunk uses a, a Turbo S hood. His trunk has an aluminum door. So uh, there's also a real nice storage compartment on the back that mine doesn't have. So the 2022 model year seems to have some uh, pretty good upgrades here in uh, Trail Series chassis. It looks good. That's what they look like when you pick them up. And this is what they look like when you use them. All right, so this is Ricky's new tube chassis. So it's video number two of the day here. All right. If this looks familiar, it's because Ricky really liked Jessica's, so he copied everything about it and then made it for a man. And by I mean man, I mean there's no leopard print on it. Otherwise, it's the same. Right. <laughs> yeah. So now, now we've got another tube chassis in Southern Land tube chassis riders. What's that? Yeah, they're they're super junk, super ATV. Yeah. All right, looks pretty good. Oh yeah, 
Another good tube chassis for us. Wasn't a good noise. Yep. Yep. Driver's front. Let's hook him up. Oh, your winch doesn't have a. F oh. Hey, Bobby. Back it up <sighs> you. Take it down and up the bypass. All right, Sonny. Careful now, you'll get it dirty. You'll get it dirty. Whoop. Huge. Big help. Yeah, I remember that one video where I think you come blazing up through the center. Jeremy went this way and somebody else went that Sonny way. went up that way, yeah. After watching what I did, he didn't mind any part of it. Out of the gas! 
Chuckalocker. <laughs> <laughs> 